Sometimes I think, depending on the situation, because sometimes, like, cuando es algo así bien pesado, like, con Pavel algo positivo, like, es difícil. Pero, pues, todo tiene, ¿ok? Su positive side, but... It's just that even the darkest moments in your life are there for a reason. For me. The first one, surround yourself with positive people. Mm -hmm. Why? Because if you're with people, ahora sí, mira, como dije, dirían por ahí, júntate con gente fregona. ¿Por qué? <laughs> yes. <laughs> you want a business? <laughs> Then surround yourself with people that have businesses. I didn't like that. Mm -hmm. And I wanted you to change it. that. So I identified the things that I didn't like and I changed them. Mm -hmm. You know? And now I'm a happier person. Because of it. Because yeah. of that. You know what? Today, uh, now that we're talking about this, I know me and my TikToks, but... <laughs> Hola, Morcas. Welcome back to Compartiendo Mitote <laughs> with Lupita and Adilene. Welcome, everyone. Welcome back. On our previous episode, we were, we were, little, we had talked about eliminating the excuses. Yes. In order for you to achieve your goals, your resolutions, or the things that you want to change in your life. Mm -hmm. But today... Today we're going to be talking about the importance of your mindset, having a positive mindset. Yes. Why is it important to have a positive mindset and how that can change a lot of your perspectives? And it, it also has to do with what you think, it's what you get. Mm -hmm. What you attract. Mm -hmm. Yes. So you think positive, you will attract positivity mm -hmm. but if you think negative you will attract negativity mm -hmm. and i don't know about you guys but i feel like i am very negative person <laughs> i don't know why like i don't know i don't know like you feel why. you see yourself <clears throat> as a very negative person yes I really, and i don't see you like that i see no. you as very happy very happy. joyful now. very <laughs> Like, very relaxed, <clears throat> maybe, goes with the flow. Maybe now I think I've learned a little bit better, like, on yeah. qué se importa, porque toda, like, era como medio preocupona y luego, ay, está el otro, que, like, yeah, I was very like that. You used to worry a lot. Yeah. I still do. Deep down, I maybe don't say it. <laughs> Pero un poco, sí. Oh, no, 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 no. <clears throat> I see a very different side of you mm. like I see it different like I don't see you as a negative person I see you as very happy very joyful um I don't know like maybe it's changed down. I don't know or maybe that no me conoces bien no pretend to say or no, no it's because no, I feel I sometimes that whenever like for example things happen mm -hmm. uh you right away like think the worst no, no. like you like You like block, hmm. like your mind is blocked. When something happens, like you blocked, like you're blocked. And then it's just what you're thinking, it's the only option. Mm -hmm. Like there's no other option, just what you think. And then you only get one option. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. True. I don't know. I just feel like sometimes thinking the worst. <laughs> And sometimes you don't feel so bad <laughs> afterwards because you're like, oh, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna share with you. And you're going to be surprised. Before, I was very negative. Really? Were you uh -huh. negative? Yes, me. Very <laughs> negative. ¿Cómo te de? De muy... Um, ¿Qué te de? Rápidamente me haces enojar. Mm -hmm. Like fire, dijo. <laughs> like I, I would get back. And then... And this, <laughs> and this, uh -huh. I used to tell you what I, whatever I was feeling, and I didn't care whatever you were feeling. Mm. You would just say, I would just say whatever, and without a I, filter. Yeah, if I hurt your feelings, I don't, I didn't care. Damn, mm -hmm. who would have that? <laughs> yeah, I'm telling you, I'm sharing with you. Mm -hmm. That has changed <clears throat> over time. I learned mm -hmm. my lessons, mm -hmm. you know. And then I was like, no, like, I don't want to be that person. Like, I don't mm -hmm. want to be like that. Yeah. So then I started to change. 
And then that's when a positive mindset <laughs> came to rescue me. <laughs> you. I think we also should start with what is a positive mindset, no? So what is know. a positive mindset, Adelene? So a positive mindset is approach every situation and challenge in life with op optimism. Mm -hmm. Which makes sense. Yeah, like ser optimista que, oh, esto pasó. Ah, like, I'm gonna get... ¿Cómo te diré? No, 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 no. Sí. Out of it. Sí. It's gonna go away or I'm gonna find a solution. Okay. Um, what is something that has happened to you that you have ever done that? Like, look for a positive. Hmm. Let me think. Put me on the spot, Lupita. Hold on. Let me think a little bit. Um. I don't know if this would be kind of a positive but sometimes we want things to happen and they don't happen for a reason and I think we need to learn can this is like I don't know if, no is that something like positive mindset or no well, All right, well, give me you give me your example maybe like, I can think about my for example one. to me mm -hmm. whenever changes happen mm -hmm. I see that as an opportunity mm -hmm. why Because I get to meet people, mm -hmm. I get to talk with different people, mm -hmm. I get to see different things, different views, perspectives. Like, yeah, like whenever, for example, Mira, whenever we bought this mobile home, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. It was like very destroyed, like mm -hmm. a very, very, very destroyed. Mm -hmm. But I didn't focus on. How it looked. How it was looking. Mm -hmm. I focused on the potential it had. Mm. I focused on, oh, you can do this. Mm. You can open here. You can do this. You can remove this. You can put this kitchen like this. You can move this other thing. You can open the floor. You can, um, like, put lights on the bedrooms. Mm -hmm. Cosas así. Mm -hmm. That's how I see things. Mm. Whenever things happen to me. Or the car... Or if I go to the store and I buy clothes or whatever, mm -hmm. like I'm, I'm picture, picturing like, oh, I can use it this way, this way, this way, this <laughs> way, this way, this way. <laughs> yes, because I'm not rich to be buying all kinds of clothes, Every you time. know? <laughs> yeah. So I focus on the positive, like the positive side. The positive things of, mm -hmm. yeah, of the situation. Hmm. It's like when you go to the doctor mm -hmm. and you're like, oh, no, I don't want the doctor to do laps on me because he's going to tell me that um, oh, I, I don't have even. this, the, like, I have to do this. I don't know that, but I don't want to do it. So I don't want to go. But then you don't focus mm -hmm. on, okay, the doctor does the lab work or whatever. And he's like, well, you have this and this problem. Mm -hmm. But you don't focus and, okay, if I do this... And for example, if you're low on a vitamin or whatever, mm -hmm. like if I take this vitamin, you're maybe not going to be feeling drowsy or like mm -hmm. tired or mm -hmm. like you don't focus on the positive mm -hmm. things. And you know what? That's you focus on the, the things negative. that you don't want to hurt. <laughs> you're here. like, oh, I know this. No, I don't want to do it. That's a good example because actually I hate going to the doctor because I'm overweight and I am. I know I'm overweight and you know the doctor's going to tell me, are you doing exercise? Like you need to do exercise. You need to eat better. Right? Like I already know. I just don't want to do it. <laughs> so that's a good point. Yeah. The like, doctor. That's how I see it. Like, I don't know. Like whenever I go to the doctor, I'm like, oh, well, yeah. Like, I don't go to the doctor thinking, es que esto, like, I have all these illnesses. No. Mm -hmm. But I do tell him, like, hello. Like, I, I have this problem. Like, hi. How can you help? Me? How are you going to help me? Yeah. What's the solution to it? What's the solution? Like, hello. Mm -hmm. I tried this. I tried that. You didn't <laughs> help me. A little bit. No, like, for real. But... I just feel the ways that you see the problem. Mm -hmm. Lupita, like, 
thinking, but I don't know. We'll come back. Just yeah. in case I remember. We can I, always I come back. Good, I don't have a good example. I'm trying mm-hmm. to we can always come back. Think. But how you were saying, and you actually sent me this article, and it's really good. And you guys can find it at betterup.com slash blog slash positive mental attitude. So we're good at uh, article. I started reading. I'm like, I'm gonna send it to Lupita. Maybe this is a good where we can get a lot of information. Well, on it, it has a lot of very um, important mm-hmm. information in here and examples. Yes, because first of all, it describes to you what is a positive mental attitude, mm-hmm. not just your mindset, but an attitude, and says. That you don't always have to be smiling and being cheerful and forcing positivity. Mm -hmm. No. But it's the way you see every situation or challenge with Mm. optimism. Mm -hmm. Because optimism is one thing. And being positive, it's it's another. True. And I also said, why? No, why it was important? Like, why... Positive yeah. attitude was important. Like it says, why it's important <coughs> important to have a positive mental attitude. Mm-hmm. And one of the things that said here was that it will help you achieve your goals. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I saw that one too, and it, it also said that it helps you reach your full potential. Like, see, look, yeah, because you discover it in yourself, like tools or things that you have like your talents mm-hmm. you discover them and then you get to utilize them mm-hmm. and it can affect your health too which i thought was kind of crazy but it, it makes sense very much sense <laughs> well it is because was it i think we have talked about this at work that there has been como Ciertas encuestas o ciertas información en la que cuando una persona tiene una un mindset negativo, por la mayoría de las veces terminan teniendo enfermedades. Sí. Can I give examples on those two patients? I'm not going to say names. No, you can't say names, girl. No, no names, but like. (laughs) You can relate to work. Oh, this would be a good example. <laughs> <laughs> but the way you see your problems will affect you. Yeah. And it also, um, I guess it has to do because um, your ability to relate to others and how they see you too. Mm. It can affect that. And it says that... It says, a positive mental attitude also strengthens your ability to Mm -hmm. navigate uncertainty and deal with stress. Mm -hmm. Mm Hasta con eso te puede ayudar. Mm -hmm. That's crazy, no? But it makes sense again. I like the quote that it referred to. Did you see it? The quote... The quote, and I think we hear it very, very often. Whatever your mind can conceive and can believe, it can ach- achieve. Como has dicho, like las cosas que tú ves, yeah. like those dreams and stuff. You, s- you use it a lot, actually, <laughs> <laughs> because it's true. Like what you s- see is what you will attract, and mm-hmm. it's what you're gonna do. Because mm-hmm. the more you see it, and you're gonna work harder to do it. Because that's what you want. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh It motivates you. Yep. And it gives five examples of uh, characteristics of a positive mindset. Mm -hmm. One of them being resilience. Mm -hmm. Then the second one. Courage. Which is being brave enough to go after the thing you want without fearing a failure, rejection, and any other fears. Mm-hmm. The third one is optimism. Ves que te que el optimismo y la positividad son separados. It says, um, optimism is the main pillar of a positive attitude. Mm-hmm. 
It's true. There's also gratitude. People who are thankful in life are help are happier and healthier. Which that brings a big point that we were talking <laughs> about this morning. Because remember whenever we were talking about gratitude. Because how sometimes we're not so grateful oh. for what we have, for what we can do, that we um, just take everything for granted and we're like, mm-hmm. I know, ahorita que salga, tengo que agarrar y tengo que llegar a la casa y tengo que cocinar. I know. Y ahí van a estar los chiquillos, chichi, chichi, grite, grite. True. But then you don't realize that <coughs> in this world, there's a lot of those people. There's a lot of people that are not able to go home, that are not able to go cook a meal. There's people that are not able to wake up. There's people that are not able to walk. There's people who are breathing out of a machine Mm -hmm. and you're able to breathe on your own. There's people wishing to be able to go on walks, to go on runs, Mm -hmm. to go to the gym, and they can't have it. And your family. That you have your family, that everyone's healthy, Mm -hmm. that there's nothing bad happening around you. Mm -hmm. But we're not grateful. Mm -mm. We always focus on the The negative side. (laughs) Yes, of course. We have to focus on, oh, no, es que tengo que que limpiar la casa, porque si yo no la limpio, nadie la va a limpiar. Mm -hmm. Oh, I have to get up for work tomorrow. Mm-hmm. Like, yeah, and I don't, at least we have a job. <laughs> and there's people that don't have a job. Mm-hmm. And would wish to have a job. Mm-hmm. That too. Mm-hmm. That's a big one. That's a very big one. And the fifth one being acceptance. We're naturally inclined to judge a situation in our life as good or bad. Which, that's also true. Because mm-hmm. last year... La familia, ¿qué te hace? Oh, fulanita se anda portando mal. Allá anda, quién sabe dónde. Oh, pero they start talking about you behind your back. Yeah. Like you start judging everything. Or maybe they shouldn't be judging people. Yeah. Or they don't accept, they talk about other people, but then their own. They don't accept their own mistakes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Or their own fires. Uh Yes, true. And I think those were the five, five, no? Yeah. Yeah. Resilience, courage, optimism, gratitude, and acceptance. Mm Mm-hmm. Which is, which of those um, most surprised you? Like, Mm. I think the gratitude one. I don't know, because also courage a little bit, because... Like, si tienes que tener, o sea, pues el valor, valor de, like, get out of that situation, or el valor de pensar diferente también, I don't know, like, it's, t- it's tough. Sometimes I think, depending on the situation, because sometimes, like, cuando es algo así bien pesado, like, con pavela algo positivo, like, es difícil. Pero pues todo tiene, okay, su positive side, but. It's just that even the darkest moments in your life, are there for a reason. reason. They're going to teach you something like... True. Yo honestamente creo que Dios no te va a mandar algo que tú no puedas Mm -hmm. soportar. Mm -hmm. Y siento que Dios no se va a sentar ahí a esperar que, like, to break you. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? I feel like you would come stronger out of that situation. Y pero está cañón en veces también oh. porque ahí también se pone a prueba tu fe todo <laughs> sí me entiendes but there are moment, moments in life that will come to you and will bombard you and then you have to you have two options <laughs> you can sit there and keep crying or you can get up and fight I mean, you're going to come with your scratches, believe me, <laughs> but you're going to learn. Mm-hmm. True. Mm-hmm. True, because imagine if our life was so perfect, I mean, I mean, you wouldn't learn nothing. You wouldn't grow. You wouldn't evolve. You wouldn't nothing. No? Because that's what teaches us the most. Well, 
it like teaches the you the most the problems mm -hmm. it helps you create a better version of you mm -hmm. sometimes those moment, moments may humble you también <laughs> mira porque sometimes algunas veces like uno piensa que no toca y no 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 that's not the case but <clears throat> all of those things are gonna teach you eventually mm -hmm. But sometimes and te pueden pasar cosas so you can change your mindset. Cause, to learn from it. Yeah, because I do think that más de que uno quiera cosas, like, God will, will always bless you. Mm. You know? It's just the way you want to see your blessing. Yo pienso en I don't know. Well, in here it says It gives out this article. It's really, really interesting. Like I told you guys, and it gives out four tips to have a man, man maintain, maintain a positive mental attitude. Mira, it's the, first says, one there. the first one. Surround yourself with positive people. Mm -hmm. Why? Because if you're with people, ahora sí, mira como dirían por ahí. Júntate con gente fregona. ¿Por qué? <laughs> yes. You want a business? Then surround yourself with people that have businesses mm -hmm. that have uh that knowledge or the that knowledge that with people that have determination the tools, the tools. with people that have determination with people that have dreams. Why? Because those people more push than likely you. they will push you but they will also also teach you. You know what? On this one I have an example too, like for example, I had friends in high school who they were in like in a lot of things, like a lot of, um, you know like, how they have like um, extracurricular activities, activities, uh -huh. and me junté con ellas y me decían, andale, vamos a ponernos like that me mesa, for example, at school. The what? Mesa? Did, no, you don't have mesa? No. No. And I joined that because of them. <laughs> and then they what went, was that? <clears throat> it's like, um, ay, Lupita. <laughs> it's like math and science like together oh, okay, they teach okay. you and it's like a little program we would go in lunch oh okay, okay. and then um, there was also like AP classes I couldn't start taking and I was like I can't I'm not good at reading like I can't take that uh, don't you have to like be at certain like, level uh -huh, para poder entrar. they're like no come on and they también me empujaron they a hacer eso. and we did it too in English and then we did one in Spanish también and it helped because it gave us credit for college oh nice and then they're gonna go to college they're planning on college and I was like I guess <laughs> I guess <laughs> I'm going to <laughs> see like they pushed me so much like I feel like neta si no me hubiera juntado con ellas I wouldn't have known no hubiera sabido nada de eso no hubiera ido yo creo ni al colegio la verdad Really? That's how much influence they have. And one of them is very, very optimistic and positive. Really? Yeah. And everything she said she wanted in high school, she has achieved now as an adult. Which I believe is so crazy because, you know. The <laughs> power was, of attraction. The power of a uh, positive, positive mindset. Yes. Yes. So if you want to be a... No sé, I don't know. Whatever you want to be. When I go to the gym more often, but well, surround yourself with people that go to the gym. Mm -hmm. That eat healthier. Mm -hmm. You know? See the reels on TikTok, Instagram, but, and Facebook. That's my type of research. Which gym, everything that has to do with the gym. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And it does motivate you. Yeah. If you want to be, I don't know, like a better cook, and then surround yourself with people that like to cook mm -hmm. you know you can learn off youtube youtube has is everything because <laughs> at i mean that's a talent mm -hmm. you know and luego it says second mm -hmm. do the inner work <laughs> which we say is the hardest <laughs> <clears throat> why because it says to maintain a positive mental attitude you have to do the work inner work that's it Inner work means reflecting on your inner world so you can relate to the outer world better. Hmm. Uh -huh. 
I think that's the hardest one, but I think you have, you know what? I think it's one of the hardest ones, but I think it's the most beneficial. Well, yes, because when you have like looking like what you don't like, for example, myself, like I'm, I'm telling you, I'm sharing with you. Before I was very negative, like rápido me enojaba and all these things, mm -hmm. but I didn't like that, mm -hmm. and I wanted you to change that. So I identified the things that I didn't like, and I changed them. Mm -hmm. You know, and now I'm a happier person because of it. Because yeah. of that. You know what? Today, uh, now that we're talking about this, I know me and my TikToks, but <laughs> and my reels, I watched a reel where it said like, if someone wants to change, you have to change their heart. Of course, not like literally no, change no, your no. heart. Pero the inner work. The animal. Uh -huh. Yeah, like. For example, if you're a person that is very jealously, mm -hmm. you know, when you see someone achieve something and you're always jealous, mm -hmm. but you don't like that, like you don't want to be like that, mm -hmm. that, that's something that you can work, mm -hmm. you know? Okay, usually, I don't know, I've heard, like on TikToks, I mean, like when people are jealous, it's because it's something behind that that they want to, but work on it if you want it to, orale. like get on yeah. it. You want it to, work for it. Mm -hmm. You can achieve it too. Yeah. I mean, el sol sale para todos. Mm -hmm. But things like that, like if you, I don't know, like if you have low patience, then that's something that you don't like, you want to change, mm -hmm. then you can. you can change that mm -hmm. too. True, true, true. Yeah. Number three. <laughs> says... Practice visualization. Mm. Ooh. Minimus ah. be no? <laughs> my vision board <clears throat> is on my screenshot of my phone. Right there. En cuanto la hora está. Yo también ya, ya le copié Lupita dijo. And you know what? It kind of does help. Like when I was at work for like the overtime, <laughs> I would look and I was like, okay. <laughs> like me quejo y luego. Oh yeah, I want that. Huh? Okay, we need to work for it. <laughs> Sacrifice. <laughs> Ni modo. Sacrifice your free days. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Okay. Yeah. Like the more you see it, mm -hmm. it's going to make you want it. Like work harder to do it. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Yes. And number four, it says meditate. Mm -hmm. Really? It says in here, daily meditation helps you let go of negative negative emotions like worry, fear, and anxiety. Hmm. Do you think and it's it trains you your relax? mind to be grounded in the present moment? Do you think it's because you relax? I have never meditated. Mm, me neither. I th I'm sorry, but I've done yoga. <laughs> and when they're like, do this, I can't tell you where to go. Maybe I don't have the thing for that, or maybe I'm not taking it seriously. I couldn't. I was like, <laughs> Ay, Lene, are you I'm guys here. really like, thinking of this? In are you guys room? still here? <laughs> Ay, Lene, I'm right here in the room. Hi, <laughs> <Hi>, neighbor. <laughs> yeah. But those are some tips that it gives in order for you to achieve your positive mindset. It also gives examples of positive attitude. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You want to share some? One was changing your perspective, like we mentioned. Yeah. La perspectiva no tiene mucho que ver. Smiling and being kind to others. I think that too. Because I don't think there's someone that... O sea, when you treat people nice, you feel good. Like when they saluda, that's when I mean, even sometimes when they don't say it back, but you feel good. Like why would you feel bad for saying hi or like being happy or smiling to someone or making someone smile? It just depends on the person. Mm -hmm. Like it depends who you are. Because uh, si tú no eres feliz, you won't share happiness True. with nobody. Like you're not happy. Like you won't share it. You know, you can but say, even if someone smiles, you wouldn't like. I would. Like, like, to me, me, like, you're like when I go to, for example, to a restaurant uh -huh. and they like I go in and they greet me. They're like, "Hi, nice. uh, good afternoon. How are you? Mm -hmm. How can I help you?" Like, to me, it makes me feel good. Mm -hmm. You know, being treated well, being treated like nice. being acknowledged, um, ¿Sí mm -hmm. like sean cordiales, things like that. Like, oh, like. Thank you, mm -hmm. you know? Very good service. Mm -hmm. Y más enfrentando los... O sea, el... Yeah. Restaurante, por ejemplo. For example, when I go... 
to the bank mm -hmm. and the bank teller is like right there like looked up and like ¿Qué quieres? <laughs> yeah there's and see, I'm like hi <laughs> I feel like honestly I'm not a tough customer I'm pretty easy like a mí no más dime buenos días esto esto lo que hay que hacer me lo das have a good day thank you bye <laughs> yeah Yeah. I don't know, like I'm good with that. And sometimes they tell me, they're like, do you work like in this? I'm like, yes. Can, can you tell? <laughs> I do. I do. Like, I don't feel like I'm a bad customer, but if you treat me bad, like, mm -hmm. yo me voy a quejar. <laughs> like, <laughs> believe me. Like, si me tratas mal, me voy a quejar, because that's not fair, you know. Mm -hmm. But if I go in and you treat me good, with respect, with kind, Mm -hmm. then You're that's good. it like I'm good like I don't need nothing else I don't need you to come and baby me every 10 minutes and check on my table and see if I'm doing okay when I'm eating my rice I'm <laughs> perfectly fine <laughs> this is what I don't like mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah I'm like you know I'm like oh God, no worries you're good 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 no worries <laughs> the third one is practicing self-compassion I think that one también tener un poquito that de empathy that interesting huh you have to be because sometimes honestly When I, I worked at customer service, sí. and sometimes I'm like, really, it's Marca? Like, qué piensa? Like, I can't solve all this. But then you hear their frustrations, and I'm like, okay, I, sh I, I should have like empathy. Like, I understand why andas como andas o desesperado, enojado, lo que sea. Ya cuando te cuentan, you're like, okay, like, por eso está así. Pero no que estoy, no estoy justificando que nos traten mal tampoco ni que nos hagan yeah. feo porque uno a veces como empleado no tiene la culpa. Pero <laughs> Like, you see where they're coming from. You understand. You understand. Which you I think goes a long like way. Una persona. Una persona normal y pues tiene sus problemas. Problemas también. como todos. Not taking things personally. Mm. Ah, eso sí es cierto. Sí. I even remember that when I was in my previous job, one of the doctors there told me, um, whenever I asked him, because I had to do some interviews, and he said... Um, I told him if he could give me some advice and he said yes don't take things personal mm -hmm. I was like oh and up to this day de ese día pa acá no puse en efecto so I'm like you come into jail and I'm just like looking at you I'm like cricket 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 more crickets cricket cricket you know what I'm I, just like I don't know what to tell you like I don't know <laughs> Yo, yo antes tomaba todo muy personal, siento. Like, really? muy buena, lo tomaba, like, oh, like, it's not me, I, I'm just an employee, I'm just following my rules, I'm sorry, like, I can't do much, but um, I think it, ahora que he estado por más tiempo en customer service, I think I've learned a little bit more to, yeah, not take it personal. No, like, take it's it personal? No, sometimes people are having bad days, like, I know, not, no siempre van a andar de buenas, todo mundo, but mm -hmm. sometimes it's not even you, it's just, yeah, they're having a bad day. Yeah. When you need to accept it and, well, we're human. <laughs> yes. But that is really true. Mm -hmm. Those were all the examples for Yeah. So, as, mindset. <clears throat> as we have talked on our previous <clears throat> video, episode 19, if you haven't checked it out, go check it out. Support us. Help us. <laughs> grow. <laughs> um, in there, we talked about eliminating the excuses. Now, you can re relate eliminating the excuses with now working towards having a positive mindset mm -hmm. which i think will help tremendously yes because how you see the problem it's what's going to make you react to the problem mm -hmm. so if you see the problem negative you're going to react negative mm -hmm. and sometimes you might take um decisiones apresuradas mm -hmm. before you have to first see think about the good things and then which is forward. crazy because i know sometimes some problems you're like there's nothing good no there is <laughs> so deep down like look keep looking or keep analyzing there mm -hmm. should be something good everything has its pros and cons and everything Yes, but with this being said, it is really important that you change the, the things in you that you don't like. Because mm -hmm. before, for example, on your vision board, mm -hmm. ¿qué tienes en tu vision board? A ver. 
okay so i have are we gonna like try it all over there or just no see? just you can pick like one or two i have my dream house okay my dream body <laughs> okay and my boutique and money <laughs> okay what about you little before i tell you now answer to me how mm -hmm. are you gonna shift those one working maybe stop spending so much two going to the gym and finding a stable job i mean <laughs> to pay the house or grow my business yeah okay so i have here first god and look at them way mm -hmm. then i have a house then i have me exercising supposedly <laughs> and then i have a picture of a studio for a podcast now the other way see por qué first god because acuérdate que toda la vida con dios todo y sin dios nada okay so first god the house why because like eventually I want a house <clears throat> where I could have and spend time with my family mm -hmm. but in order to do that I need to make sure I'm healthy mm -hmm. so then I want the podcast to go mm -hmm. right eventually we want a studio no si estamos con todo queremos todo Um, someday but how am I gonna ship these things first of all mira I have to be ponerme las pilas hacer ejercicio comer bien dormir bien um, trabajar pero no sobre trabajar <laughs> ¿entiendes como? Sí, sí, be balance. smart eventually trabajar en el podcast ¿para qué? para que crezca. Mm -hmm. So the, what, the more I see it, whenever me, no me la hago así el teléfono, I see it. Maybe we should flip it at least. So let's see. Yeah. Let's, let's show him a little bit. Why well, well, is mine on TikTok? We'll try it again. Go, you first. Todavía no, nos, no aprendemos mucho en la edición. So make sure if you have any tips, let us know. <laughs> yes. Make it more clear. But the more I see those things that I want, mm -hmm. the harder I'm going to work mm -hmm. to get them accomplished. Mm -hmm. ¿Ya ves que se me fue el mandado? No, 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 no. esta semana? I have taken lunch por tres semanas, ¿ah? Ya llevo tres semanas de ando lonche no comprado. Te sí, plumita. Ay no, three weeks straight. Ando llevando lonche. Ya. So, I don't know if you guys have done your vision boards, but if not, do them. It doesn't take long. No, you just get a collage and then whatever you want, look through pictures that motivate you, to screenshot them or save them, and que no me los pones ahí. Yeah. yeah. Oh, es man, y las tienes que poner. <coughs> bueno, I did this app and it just las acomoda. Oh, nice. I was like, oh. But I wanted more, but it didn't fit no more. <laughs> and then I have 300 pictures. <laughs> That's yes. not, not enough. So, um, we have. Let's also give them an update on our challenge. Because we have a challenge from episode one that we started. <laughs> ¿Te acuerdas? Yeah. So. Last Friday, you posted your first video of how you're going to achieve your resolution. Mm -hmm. ¿Te acuerdas? <laughs> I, I haven't done it. nothing else. Uh, with that. No he nada más. <laughs> Then, today, I posted mine, mm -hmm. right? So, next Friday, it's your turn again to give them an update on our challenge. I don't know if you guys want to see it every week or should we make it like every, like the starting of the week to post how our challenge is going. 
I don't know. Whichever? Yeah. The beginning or the So, end. next Friday te toca. Right? Because we're starting. <laughs> like, we are taking baby steps. Like, we have to start from zero up. That's how we're starting. Bueno, por lo menos yo sí. Then, <laughs> ando bien en el cero hasta... Please, I want to see my hundred. <laughs> yes. So, we're going to keep you guys updated on our challenge. If you want to join, go ahead and join us. Follow Share. our journey. Comment what you guys are doing or what are you, what are you guys' resolutions and yeah. how you're going to get there. And remember, no excuses. And how are you guys going to achieve those goals? And then we should actually on this second week, we should um, also include positive mindset with our challenge. So share whatever you're doing on the challenge mm -hmm. to achieve your goal. Mm -hmm. And then one thing that you're working Changing. on to, up, to have a positive mindset. Mm. Lupita me está dando tarea <laughs> Yes Because <laughs> uh, si tenemos que cambiar Tenemos mm -hmm. que cambiar todo You, you have to we'll first start it. here mm -hmm. True Okay Ready? Anything else? No <laughs> I'm scared now <laughs> She's like I, I have didn't my want done. to go to school <laughs> <laughs> Yes So with this being said you guys This is it for today's episode We'll see you on the next one Bye, Bye.